What's up? My name's Dactone. I'm your favorite YouTuber's favorite YouTuber. That's not true. <laughs> hey, uh, what's up, y'all? Uh, it's your boy. Also, not your boy. Anywho, moving on. For new unit, Indra. Have you heard of her? You probably haven't. Do you have her? Probably not, too. Um, I got stupid lucky, and I used her the other day in my Annihilation Dude Cheese Showcase, and I got so many comments being like, oh, I'm Chinese player. I played this game for one year, never pulled her. Uh, you lucky son of a bitch. So, it was only right for me to do a showcase for her. Now, this unit can do some ludicrous shit for being titled an okay unit. Here's an idea, buddy. You're an okay unit. She is fucking awesome. And she's so cool looking, man. Now, the plan was to eat to her. And when I do do that... God, I said it again. When I do that... I'll do that. I'll make another one. I'll make another one. But for now, dude, she can do some ludicrous shit at E1, and it would be an injustice if I did not showcase that shit right now. Now, there's a couple places I want to go. I made sure I want to put her in uh, as many places as I could as possible, and we're going to start off right off the bat with CE5. Now, CE5, you know, you can bring about 10 or 12 units in this shit, uh, but let me show you what I did. So, here's my new team. Let's get right into it. Okay. I was super happy about this shit. I did it just today on uh, Twitch chat. Twitch.tv forward slash Tectone if you haven't heard of it. It's a pretty cool place. Uh, yeah. M moving on. Discord.gd forward slash Tectone as well. Anyway, check shit out. Okay. Four units, right? Four units so far. All right. Indra facing up. Okay. Because Siege, you know, she can't hold it down by herself. Okay. She may be a great unit, but uh, even even the six stars need a little bit of help from, uh, from, their, from their betters every now and then. Now... The damage right now is okay, right? The damage right now is okay. But I want you to see what happens when she pops her ability, okay? When she pops her ability, now you watch. Her paws are going to start lighting up blue. Favorite color, by the way. So, you know, she's running brownie points there. But just watch the shit that she can do. Ignore Mia. She's on the side. She's just doing her own thing. Ignore her, okay? That's an armored unit, right? Now, just watch when she pops that shit, okay? Doing okay damage, okay? She's going to pop it. You ready for this shit? It's coming. I promise. <laughs> Indra. There we go. As their health evaporates, okay? That's not Exia. That's not Ausai. That's not Siege. That's not Shige. She turns her abilities into magic damage, and then she heals for 10 to 15%, depending on how you have her ranked, of uh, the damage dealt. Yeah, that's ridiculous, by the way, because the one weakness that she has, which is, you know, arm and units, don't matter. It straight up don't matter. She can do both, which is absurd. Now, she does have a first ability, which is, um, you know, increase, like, attack by 80% and ignore defense by 35% every four attacks. But when you're doing magic damage, every single one of your abilities ignores armor, so it doesn't even matter. The flexibility of this unit is insane, okay? Lapland is considered one of the best units in the entire game she's a five-star, right? Indra does a very similar effect to her, but she also does the magic damage swap, and she also heals. Now, it's not a silence, but silence is very niche. Having a healer, or having a tank or a guard that needs to heal itself, is not niche. It is very easy to find a spot for Indra in pretty much any place that you go. Now, the one big downside to her is that she can only block one unit, okay? That is a massive downside, but regardless, man, just pair her up with somebody, alright? She'll beat the shit out of them. By the way, in case you haven't noticed, um, at E1, all right, and at E2, because the cost doesn't go up. Did you notice how much she cost last round? She cost 10. She cost 10. 10. That's three cheaper than AUSI. That's like 10 cheaper than Silver Ash. It's insane. Now, Silver Ash, you know, he is dope as shit. But just wait to see what my Indra can do for my team here, okay? Now, this team, I'm going to put her in the top left. Now, the top left is notorious for having some big old boys that suck balls to deal with. But don't worry. When you have Indra, they're an absolute joke. So just wait, okay? I love this shit, okay? We have the prelude. We have the prelude to the reckoning. And don't worry. At the end of this video, I'm going to show how gratuitous her damage can do when you put her in the right places. And uh, try to show you how to, like... right now now watch his health that is a full armor unit the only dps on it there's a little bit of damage coming from uh from uh af Yala. but that I, I guarantee you like 10 percent of that damage going to that armor unit that's all indra man she attacks so goddamn fast 
Very fast. I believe, I believe max attack speed. I believe max attack speed. It's, 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 it's ludicrous. It is ludicrous. She made those armored units look like level 1 lackeys when they used to look like level 99 Mafia bosses. Shout out to Mafia City. When's it coming back? I miss it. Anywho. Yeah. I've been loving this unit, dude. Do it again. And, it, yo, this ship recharges quickly, eh? Now, I know I have a Telopsis. I know I have a Telopsis. But regardless, dude. Watch him. Watch him. Okay? He's there, right? He's there, right? Nah, he dead. Nah, he dead. God, it is it is so absolutely ludicrous how fun that unit is. How cool that unit is. Now, once again, I could E2 it. But the only difference that there is between E2 and E1 Indra is some base stats. Which, you know, that is very important. I don't mean to downplay that. And then her passive gets buffed slightly. It's really not that big of a deal. Now, Twitch chat did tell me I'd be chicken if I didn't uh, E2 Indra. Shout out to Twitch chat once again. Um, and I'm working on it. I am working on it because I love this unit and I want to use it even more. Uh, but now let me show you my favorite place to go and test out uh, <laughs> a, a solo unit's potential. All right. Let's bust this shit real quick. Are y'all ready to witness the world's greatest 1v1 that you've ever seen. Now, there is a notorious NPC on this map. His name is Skull Shatterer, okay? What's he do? He shatters skulls, okay? I know, kind of deceptive. But I want to show you the shit that you can do in a really dope 1v1, okay? Trust, okay? Trust. It's going to be awesome. I'm going to put Injury right here. I'm going to put Texas up there. We're going to be a little bit patient, Okay. Oh, I love setting up for this. It's it's so it's so just straight up unnecessary, but at the same time, so much goddamn fun. Uh, did we put eggs here? No, let's not put eggs yet. Let's put uh, let's put Telopsis here real quick. Yeah, put Telopsis right here. Okay, <laughs> we might not beat the level. Let me rephrase that. One hundred percent, we're not going to beat the level. But it ain't about beating the level. Okay, it's about sending the message. All right. Okay, we're going. And as you can see, this guy's. Trying to make me have a bad day. Honestly, kind of succeeding right now, okay? Gonna pop. No, we're not gonna pop that shit yet. We're gonna pop this shit. We're gonna pop this shit. And now begins the... No, no, we're gonna hold up on the 1v1. Now, if you don't know anything about Skull Shatterer, when he hits below 50%, his damage is going to really, 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 really turn up. So we gotta hold off getting there until we're ready. And then when we're ready, we get in there. Now, prepare to see the 1v1. Okay, his health is about to drop. We're gonna pop everything. And we're going to get in there, Chief, okay? And we're ready, and there comes the... Oh, that's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. But we're going. Look at this. Look at this 1v1, man. Taking this dude one-on-one. -on -one. Easy, dude. He can't, even, he can't even drop his HP. It's so free, dude. Okay, drop this shit. Heal. Yo, heal, baby girl. Come on. We got to win the 1v1. Come on. Come on. We had it. We had it. I promise you we had it, regardless. <laughs> Yeah, that, that shit didn't mean anything. But uh, I, I love challenging that guy to a boxing match, man. It's so <laughs> dumb. But yeah, that's uh, that's that's what I... That's pretty much league when somebody says, get 1v1, noob. Okay, now I know somebody's going to ask this in the comments. Tech down, how in the hell did you get injured? Once again, she can only be gotten via recruitment. If you need to know um, how to get her yourself, I made a recruitment guide video. It's somewhere on my channel. Be like, you're recruiting wrong. Or some dumb shit like that. Uh, I got her here off the of senior operator and guard tactics, which was so sick. Um, but now I want to talk about possible combos. So, Indra and Telopsis is dope. Because Telopsis goes good with everybody. She helps her recharge her second ability faster. Uh, and then also she pairs very well with Sora. The more damage um, Indra does by her, the more she heals. And there's also another character called Warfarin, which I don't have. Which hopefully I'll get soon. That are going to make these spotlight videos, dude, so much better. That's why I need, I need Indra... Sorry, I need uh, Telopsis, Warfarine, and Sora. And those are going to be the three to make these spotlight videos absolutely obnoxious. Now, I'm coming to you. Uh, first of all, hope you enjoy the video. But I also wanted to know, um, is there any other unit? Uh, by the way, I'm doing a stupidly, stupidly aggressively gratuitous um, video tomorrow showcasing my girl, my girl AUSI, or Exia, if you want me to say it correctly. Uh, but yeah. Um, they're going to be great. But let me know. Is there any unit in particular that you want me to uh, spotlight coming up soon? Videos I have coming up right now. Um, Indra Spotlight, Telopsis Spotlight, uh, Exia Spotlight. I'm going to be doing which six-star unit that you should eat to first. 
But yeah, let me know if there's any videos you want me to do. Uh, meme or guide. I don't care. I'll do them all. I just want to make more videos for this game. And uh, hey, don't think I'm running out of ideas. But I'm sure there's one if there's anyone that you want to see first. But yeah, hey, I love this fucking game. Uh, I hope you're having fun. I'm having a blast. Hope you'll join me on Twitch and the Discord. Twitch.tv forward slash techdown. Discord.gg forward slash techdown. All lowercase. Uh, but yeah, hope to see you there. Anywho, I've been techdown. Y'all have been great. Hope y'all are having a damn good one. And as always, peace.